Hi. Uh, let's get into a, a subject that uh, I learned the hard way, and that's netting fish. Um, whenever I'm in a boat large enough to carry a net, I carry a net. Um, it's not worth losing a big fish at the side of the boat when you're fishing crankbaits or any bait for that matter. Get the fish under control, use a net. You don't have to lift the fish into the boat with the net, but you got to carry one with you because you're going to lose big fish from time to time if you don't take the tools that you need to land those big fish. That hurts. So I'm going to make another video and I'm going to go over some techniques, but also think about what kind of lure you're fishing when you fish when you're going to be using a net. Uh, you need to look at the hooks when the fish comes near the surface to see how well it's hooked. And you also need to uh, have the person netting not be so aggressive if you're using a crankbait because if he swipes by the fish and he hangs the hooks but not the fish, the fish is gone, you know, angry fisherman, uh, I'm sure the netter feels bad. Uh, it, anything in fishing takes practice. So think about these things and I'll go over a little bit more in another video real quick. Uh, it's an important aspect of landing big fish and it is so necessary. When I don't use the net, I sit in my driver's seat. I don't have to bend way over. I just reach over the boat and I lift the fish. So uh, I use a net a lot, but at times I see the fish is hooked well. I'd much rather land them. I never pull them out of the water. I control the fish in the net, then I reach into the net and pull the fish into the boat without lifting them out of the water with the net. So just think about those things. If you have any questions, let me know. I'll see you on YouTube, guys.